Did you know India imports 98% of its solar glass mostly from China and Vietnam even though domestic manufacturers can meet 84% of the demand? Yes, a recent investigation by the Directorate General of Trade Remedies that is DGTR revealed how cheap imports from these countries have significantly hurt Indian solar glass producers. Following the report, DGTR has recommended reimposing anti-dumping duties to protect local manufacturers. Key players like Borosil Renewables, which produces 78% of India's solar glass, have long called for measures against unfair trade practices. Uh, additionally, solar glass uh, manufacturers are looking at is to reintroduction of uh, anti-dumping duty, which was earlier continued from 2017 to 2022. And uh, after August 22, the glass manufacturers are suffering because there is no anti-dumping duty, and the glass imports are uh, increasing every day, which is putting pressure on the selling prices of local producers. And uh, we have moved. Uh, 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 domestic industry, we have moved an application to the government to reintroduce anti-dumping duty against China and also Vietnam. Uh, we are expecting a positive outcome in the whole process, maybe by by end of this quarter. And uh, post that, I think uh, you may call Achhe Din Wapas Aayenge. Borosil, for instance, had to cut prices to compete with ultra-cheap Chinese imports, cutting into its profits. Other manufacturers, including Gobind Glass and Industries, Triveni Renewables, Vishaka Glass and Gold Plus Float Glass stand to benefit from this move too. Finance Minister Nirmala Sitaraman also reinstated a 10% customs duty on solar glass imports in the Union Budget 2024. To support energy transition, I propose to expand the list of exempted capital goods for use in the manufacture of solar cells and panels in the country. Further, in view of sufficient domestic manufacturing capacity of solar gas, glass and tinned copper interconnect, I propose not to extend the exemption of custom duties provided to them. Domestic manufacturers, however, have demanded even stronger tariffs to combat ultra-low prices. Now, with both customs duties and the potential return of anti-dumping duties, India's solar glass industry finally sees a glimmer of hope.